Hello there, and welcome to episode 157 of my quest to play Norway perfectly on GeoGuessr. That is, I aim to play the maps of each and every single one of Norway's 356 communes to a GeoGuessr score of 25,000 points each. Today we have made it to the commune of Krødsherad. Now Krødsherad is located in southern Norway, inland. Oof, a couple of hours from our Oslo, and it is centered around the southern, well, southern two thirds of the Krødren Lake. There are two villages here. We've got Nordesen, which is the main one, and then we have Krødren at the south end. Also, this place is known for hosting some of the alpine skiing events in the 1952 Winter Olympics up in the Nordefjell here. And I cannot say that I know this area. I've only been through on this trunk road here, the, the seven, a couple of times. So I have no experience with this area at all. So that should be interesting to have a look at. First, we will have a look at the facts about the commune. Herad. Right, at least this looks like a promising start. So could we already be in the Nordesund maybe? Uh, well, it would help if I was looking at the right like I think we might actually be in Kröderen because I spy a railway line. Now the railway line here ends here at Kröderen and uh, it runs up from, I believe it is from Vikersund, is it? Yes, comes out here from Vikersund in, uh, in Modum and uh, this railroad is now run as a museum railroad. So yeah, that Makes it fairly easy to figure out where we are. Now we just need to pinpoint this thing. And um, well, we're quite, quite close to shore. But I think. Let's see. Can we use that house? <laughs> Jörnerede. That is. That's a nice one. So, Örnerede would be the eagle's nest. And Jörn is a male name so it's Jörn's nest now let's see so that is that I think that is that yeah most likely so that means we're looking straight north and we're looking a little past looking a little past this corner of the building let's see unless it's that one <laughs> mm. no well, we're gonna count so let's see. Because hmm. I really don't want to get this one wrong. Then again, how wrong could we be? We're slightly south of that promontory, so that should put us there. That can't be too wrong. I'm messing about for a long time, four meters away. Okay. This could be on the seven. The 
this could actually very well be on the 7. This is probably one something to... Oh, okay. So it's not on the 7. So we are... This is on the road out of Nordesund. So what would we have? Bends like these by Nordesund, like maybe out here. Can we find... Let's see, the lake is very narrow here. So it kind of feels like we should be down here. So we have a farm here, all these some old farm buildings. Let's see that. Fits quite nicely. And let's see that building. Should be that one. And we are looking at the western corner of it. Which should place us about there. How does that look? Southwest of that corner. No, we should be further up. Well, let's see, we're not on the bend, but we do have a fair few meters to go by. I'd say we're about here. Four meters away, good. Oops. Did not expect this. And here we are, which coming are we coming up to? Coming up to Sigdal. Okay, so Sigdal is over here. So this must either be this road, or this road, or this road. Okay, I got something to choose between. So southwest, I think most likely this one. And okay, so we do have a, an intersection right on the border. So let's say that we are up here somewhere. Oh no, I will need something more to go by. Let's see what's coming up here. All right. Mm, go steadily northeast. Which strongly indicates that this is the place. We could, of course, be here as well, but I have my doubts. Hmm. The road we were looking at was barred, wasn't it? Let's see now. How does this match? There is a slight bend to the road. And yeah, the road always also goes right. And then it has a slight bend off that way. The road goes up to the side like so. Yes. And let's see. Let's see. Okay, so then we get you know, we'll have a slight curve. Yes. And then we're going to have a Bend to the right of the this little bend. And then we're gonna have a sharper curve to the left, and then a long sweeping right hander. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, another left-hander. Yes, okay, we're well, somewhere around here. So let's see. We're past this bit. Ooh, this is gonna be a tough one. Let's see, so here we are. Let's see. So this bendy bit here that ends just about here, I would say that we are. So what do you reckon? One, two, three to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to the road. So if that is eight, that's four. That means as a sign should be, or oh, that we should be around there. So that is uh, by no means a certainty, but we'll give that. Well, that's from the far, isn't it? So if that is twenty meters. That's a good hundred meters. Well, it should be. Nice. Okay. Hmm. Another road up in the mountains, or at least the mountain sides. And here we are, Nordheim. Nordheim Field 365. Okay, so Nordheim and Puttansetervein. Okay. So we're up in the ski resort area. And where would Nordheim be? And what's the lay of this road? East, west, okay. Mm. Nordheim. Put on set rain, right. Okay, so we are looking westwards. And that ought to be there. So we should be uh, we should be roughly here, shouldn't we? Let's see how much of a Bend this there here. Yeah, there is a bit of a bend. There is a bit of a bend. So yeah, that ought to be fairly good. I do have a slight bend. I'm going to try that. Nice. Back in the woods. Oh, and we're along the railroad. So that doesn't give me many options. And the railroad is on the eastern side of the road. So we are somewhere between here. Let's see, Klöftefoss. I guess we're still in Kyrgyzland. And now we're coming over to the next commune. So... <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, it looks to be on a windy bit of the road. Let's go north this time. Yeah, that's actually quite windy. It's parking. No, that's just just the parking space. Nowhere to go.
Are we about? Okay, so there's a landfill. Is it Egedal? Is that what it's called? Elgedal. So can that be it? No. But it also looks like that we are. Yes, we're crossing the railroad here. Hmm. So that sort of fits with this place. There's no mentioning of a landfill here, but it doesn't have to be. And let's see, once we get across the railroad here, is the railroad up to the side? Should be just as we hit this bend. Grober Gleevein. Well, that looks to fit. Okay, so we are probably there. So, what am I going to find when I go around this bend then? Oh, wait a minute. Oh yeah, here's the landfill. Wow, that's that's a long way to go. Fair enough. I'm not going to judge them for that. But yeah, we are definitely coming down on this bend. And we got some houses over here. Coming around the bend. Road off to the side. Yeah. Okay. So we are on this bend. Looking north. We are one, two, and we're out of the bend. Okay, so two that way, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen to get out of the bend that way. That's sixteen, that's a nice number. So let's see, the bend ends. Uh, what does the bend end? Ends about there. And there. Let's see. So if sixteen, that's eight, four, two. And seven meters away. Cool. And that was Kruds had out as well. And another little quick playthrough that was a nice little breakdown of the area. We got the two main villages, Nordesun, Kredren, and then out in the wilds. So that's episode 157 done. Check in tomorrow for episode 158. Until then, bye bye.